um, the, the person who inspired me to play tennis and give me, me get make me better is this a pro tennis player called Rafael Nadal. He never gives up and it makes me never give up. So back in 2020 when we all had to be in lockdown, I realized that you know we had to stay fit and I started doing coaching and all my students are starting to do much better. So now I actually start having to hit with them more. So I'm trying to keep my game up. So that's a huge motivation is to be the best coach and be the best player that I can be and continue that. things I would like the most. We went to a summer camp for one summer year at Baylor University and we were dorm buddies but and also on the court we try and get better than each other, win more matches than each other so that's a good experience for, for my pay, for my half. Yeah so I, I remember that experience as well but probably uh, on the friendship aspect we are also dorm buddies. So we signed up together, but we also, you know, he, he was in my room as well. <laughs> I remember goofing off all the time, so uh, that I'll never forget that. So. Uh, the one experience I would like the most, we went to a summer camp for one summer year at Baylor University. And we were dorm buddies, but, and also on the court, we try and get better than each other win more matches than each other so that's a good experience for, for my pay, for my half. Yeah so I, I remember that experience as well but probably uh, on the friendship aspect we are also dorm buddies so we signed up together but we also you know he, he was in my room as well <laughs> I remember goofing off all the time so uh, that I'll never forget that so I got into tennis uh, for my family. My family, um, Bill, my grandmother, uh, taught me how to play tennis, and they're both tennis coaches. So I remember in 2012, I was watching on TV the Wimbledon final, Federer versus Murray, and that was when I started to figure out that I wanted to play again. And I started to teach myself all these things that I still use today. So I'm pretty much self-taught. So that's kind of where that comes from. I've had it together. Uh, the one experience I would like the most, we went to a summer camp for one summer year at Baylor University. And we were dorm buddies, but and also on the court, we try and get better than each other, win more matches than each other. So that's a good experience for for my pay, for my half. Yeah, so I I remember that experience as well. But probably uh, on the friendship aspect, we are also dorm buddies. So we signed up together, but we also, you know, he he was in my room as well. I remember goofing off all the time, so uh, that I'll never forget that. So, yeah. I love the chase and the hunt, and I set the pace when I'm running. I always take what I want, and I always give it 100. Don't need a bank, no, I'm funded. Play the game like it's nothing. I'm always thankful for. Something. Don't take for granted, stay humble. Now wake up! It's time to look at the enemy. Look in the mirror, if he is no friend to me. It's not working now, maybe it's the chemistry. It's time to break up. So describe a word uh, that describes your friendship. Mine <laughs> 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 was interesting. Uh, we're both making each other laugh. We're also trying to make it be um, better. Why we <laughs> try to get better in, in tennis? We always make us laugh. <laughs>